welcome all welcome to the first chapter the first chapter is turning forces so when a force is applied on a body we know that it will move so that means there are two types of motions are there first is translational motion when a force is applied on a body and the body is free to move then the motion is called as translational motion when we are applying a force on a body the if the body is pivoted then the force which we are applying on it will makes the body to turn and this types of motion we call it as rotational motion and from the rotational motion we can get into the main our topic of this chapter that is turning forces and what do you mean by turning forces the turning effect of force we call it as turning forces and that we can call it as torque or moment of force so now how can we define the torque torque is the product of the force which we applied and the perpendicular distance between the line of action of force to the axis of rotation magnitude and also direction and let's see what are the two factors affecting it the two factors mainly from the equation which i have said or the definition which i have specified you can see that it depends upon the force which we are applying on the body to turn and also the perpendicular distance between the line of action of force and the axis of rotation and just see the example of the door when we are applying the force on the door it will turn and that is an example of torque and what is the si unit of torque that is newton meter as the torque depends upon the force and the perpendicular distance the unit of force is newton and the perpendicular distance is meter and in the case of cgs unit what is the unit of force that is dyne unit of distance that is called as centimeter so finally we will get the unit of torque in cgs system is dyne centimeter when in the relation between the two units we can see 1 newton meter is equal to how much dyne that is 10 to the power 5 dyne will be equal to 1 newton into 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter that means 1 meter newton meter 1 newton meter is equal to 10 to the power 5 into 10 to the power 2 dyne centimeter and that finally we will get as 10 to the power 7 dyne centimeter that means 1 newton meter is equal to 10 to the power 7 dyne centimeter let's come to the examples what are the main examples of the torque first one just as i have said earlier the opening and closing of the door when we are applying the force on the door at the handle the door will be turning where do we keep the handle at the very farthest distance from the axis of rotation so so that the perpendicular distance will be more and we can apply less force to turn the door or open and close the door and next comes the steering wheel when when where we apply the force on the steering wheel that is on the rim of it why we are applying over there only less force only we need to apply to turn it because when we are applying like that then the perpendicular distance from the axis of rotation will be more next example is the case of floor grinder which is given in your textbook and that is when we are rotating the floor grinder we are applying the force at the rim of the wheel so that we only less force is required to turn the grinder and next the spanner in order to tighten a screw or loosen a screw we will be using spanners and where do we apply the force at the very farthest distance from the axis of rotation why mainly if you are doing like that we are increasing the perpendicular distance so that only less force to turn that object so you are clear with what is the torque and the unit the relationship between the units and what are the factors affecting it and torque is a vector quantity so we can see that what are the directions of the torque that is there are two ways are there clockwise and anti-clockwise if a body is turning and if a body is turning in clockwise direction we can call it as clockwise moment and it is taken as negative and in order to represent the anti-clockwise moment, we will consider the positive symbol. So I think all have understood this and thanks for watching.